The Ultimate Product Catalog plugin comes with two shortcodes, Product Catalog and Insert Products. This video will cover the attributes each one can accept and give examples of which shortcode should be used in different situations. The main plugin shortcode is Product Catalog, which is used to insert catalogs that you create into any page on your WordPress site. The page should be a full width page for the catalog to display correctly, without any additional customization required. This shortcode requires one attribute, ID, which is the ID of the catalog that you want to insert. This attribute is already included in the shortcode for copying and pasting from the Catalogs tab of the plugin menu. There are three main attributes that can be included with this shortcode. Excluded layouts, starting layout, and sidebar. Excluded layouts will exclude any or all of the default catalog layouts. It accepts a comma-separated list of the layouts that you want to exclude, which are thumbnail, list, and detail. This attribute can be used to speed up the load time for large catalogs by about one-third per layout excluded. Some users also choose to exclude the list layout for SEO purposes so that the product description for each product isn't in the source code for the main product page. Starting layout will let you choose a layout that the catalog should open to, with the default being thumbnail. When using this attribute, make sure that the starting layout isn't being excluded using the excluded layouts attribute, or your catalog will open to a blank page. Finally, the sidebar attribute can be used to hide the default sidebar, which can be useful for a smaller catalog or using the catalog on a page with a theme sidebar included. To hide the sidebar, simply set this attribute to no. The second shortcode, Insert Products, is used to include a small set of products on a page or a different theme area, such as a footer. It is also useful if you are looking to put a small product listing into a drop-down menu or any other feature that can be displayed on Hover or using JavaScript. The attributes for this shortcode include Catalog URL, which needs to be set for visitors to be able to actually click on a product to view its full listing. The next two attributes are optional, product count and products wide. Both of these fields default to three if you decide not to enter them. Products wide can be set to any number between one and four and product count can be set to any number. Although it may be ignored if the number is too high based on the other attributes and end up just showing the maximum number of products. You will also need to fill out one of the following, product IDs, catalog ID, category ID, or subcategory ID. Product IDs takes a list of product IDs that you'd like to display, which can be found by clicking on a product from the Products tab of the Admin menu. Catalog ID will show a number of random products from the catalog ID that you enter. Category ID will display a number of random products from the selected category. Subcategory ID will display a number of random products from a subcategory. If all of them are entered, then only the product list listed in the Product IDs field will show. Check out the plugin page on our website for additional information or subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date with future tutorial videos for this and other plugins.